Back in the 1980s and 1990s, Black female singers introduced a whole new era of music. By combining Black music and the experience of the past with their lethal lyrics and voices, these Black singers literally dominated the music industry. Such was their charisma that you would hear their songs playing no matter where you go. Whether at a party, in a bar, a restaurant, or in your car, you would hear their hit songs. That was the very fine era people miss today. However, where have the singers of one of the most famous songs gone? Back in the 1990s, they were young princesses. But what about now? How do they look and whether they have the same voices and beauty? Welcome to a new episode of Black Afric Diary, a channel where we talk about Black African history, culture, arts, and civilization. It's a place where you will see the real picture of Black Africa, its stories, and the events defining it. In this episode, we will tell you about the 15 most beautiful and famous Black female singers of the 1990s, where they are today, and how they look. Let's get started. Number 15. Roberta Flack Roberta Flack, born on February 10, 1937, became an acclaimed American singer, songwriter, and musician renowned for her soulful voice and dynamic songwriting. Her breakthrough came in the 1970s with the release of her debut album, First Take, in 1969, featuring the hit single, The First Time Ever I Saw Your Face, propelling her into the spotlight. Throughout her illustrious career, Flack garnered multiple Grammy Awards and delivered timeless classics like Killing Me Softly with His Song and Feel Like Making Love, establishing herself as an icon in soul music. Collaborating with diverse artists, she showcased her vocal prowess and musical versatility. In 2024, Roberta Flack, now in her late 80s, maintains a respected status within the music community, though less active in the industry. Her legacy endures through her timeless recordings, influencing generations of musicians, and earning recognition for her contributions to soul and R&B music. Despite her age, Flack exudes timeless elegance and grace, her beauty transcending superficial standards rooted in her enduring talent, wisdom, and profound impact on the music world. Number 14. Dawn Robinson Dawn Robinson, born on November 24, 1968, left her mark as an American singer and songwriter, rising to fame as a member of the R&B group En Vogue in the early 1990s. Robinson's unique voice and captivating stage presence contributed to the group's success with hits like My Lovin', You're Never Gonna Get It, and Don't Let Go, Love. After leaving En Vogue, Robinson pursued a solo career, collaborating with various artists and solidifying her reputation in contemporary R&B music. In 2024, now in her mid-50s, she is still actively involved in music through recording, performing, or exploring new creative avenues. Beyond music, Robinson could engage in philanthropic efforts or other ventures, leveraging her influence and talents for a positive impact. Despite the natural effects of aging, Dawn Robinson's beauty shines through her confidence, talent, and the emotional depth she brings to her music. Her mature allure captivates audiences, reflecting an authenticity that surpasses mere physical appearance. Number 13. Angie Stone Angie Stone, born on December 18, 1961, rose to prominence as a prominent American singer, songwriter, and actress. Initially recognized as part of the hip-hop trio The Sequence in the late 1970s, Stone's solo career skyrocketed with her debut album Black Diamond in 1999. This album featured hits like No More Rain, In This Cloud, establishing her as a powerhouse in R&B and soul music. Throughout her career, Stone continued to release albums and collaborate with other artists, showcasing her versatility and enduring talent with tracks such as Wish I Didn't Miss You and Brother. In 2024, now in her early 60s, Stone may still be active in the music scene, possibly recording new music, performing live, or exploring acting. Angie Stone's beauty in 2024 reflects her inner confidence, wisdom, and timeless elegance. Despite aging, her presence exudes a magnetic charm and sophistication, transcending superficial standards and resonating through her contributions to music and entertainment. Number 12. Charlene Keyes. Charlene Keyes, known as Tweet, was born on January 21, 1971, emerging as a recognized American singer-songwriter. Rising to prominence in the early 2000s with her debut album, Southern Hummingbird, in 2002, 
Tweet charmed audiences with her soulful voice and enchanting performances, particularly with the hit single, Oops Oh My, featuring Missy Elliott. Tweet's subsequent albums like It's Me Again and Charlene maintained her devoted fan base drawn to her authenticity and artistry. In 2024, now in her early 50s, Tweet may still be active in the music industry, possibly exploring new creative avenues or pursuing interests beyond music. Tweet's beauty in 2024 reflects her maturity, confidence, and distinctive sense of style. Despite time, her allure remains undeniable, resonating through her music and personal presence. She embodies a beauty rooted in her talent, resilience, and inner strength. Number 11, Tracy Chapman. Tracy Chapman, born in Cleveland, Ohio on March 30, 1964, is an acclaimed American singer-songwriter known for her heartfelt vocals and deeply resonant lyrics. Her musical journey began while she was studying at Tufts University, where she honed her guitar skills and started composing her own songs. In 1988, Chapman rose to prominence with the release of her self-titled debut album, Tracy Chapman. The album's standout track, Fast Car, catapulted her to fame, earning her multiple Grammy Awards and widespread praise. Chapman's unique blend of folk elements with socially conscious themes struck a chord with audiences worldwide. Throughout the years, Chapman continued to deliver acclaimed albums such as Crossroads, 1989, New Beginning, 1995, and Our Bright Future, 2008, each delving into themes of social justice, love, and personal reflection. As of 2024, Tracy Chapman has chosen to lead a more private life, stepping away from the spotlight while occasionally treating fans to live performances. Despite her reduced public presence, Chapman, now in her 60s, still possesses a timeless elegance and natural allure that have captivated audiences for decades. Number 10, Ladisi. Ladisi was born on March 28, 1972, in New Orleans, Louisiana. She's a celebrated American singer-songwriter renowned for her commanding vocals and dynamic stage presence. Ladisi began refining her craft at a young age, influenced by her mother's musical background. Ladisi's breakthrough came with her debut album, soul singer The Revival, in 2000, laying the groundwork for a career marked by critical acclaim and commercial success. Follow-up albums like Lost and Found, 2007, and Turn Me Loose, 2009, further solidified her reputation as a formidable talent. Among Ladisi's standout hits is Pieces of Me, from her 2011 album of the same name, which garnered Grammy nominations and reinforced her status as a powerhouse vocalist and gifted songwriter. Throughout her career, Ladisi has embraced a variety of musical genres, including jazz, R&B, and soul, showcasing her versatility and artistry. In 2024, she remains a dominant figure in the music scene, releasing new music and captivating audiences with her unwavering passion and magnetic presence. Now in her early 50s, Ledisi continues to exude confidence and grace both on stage and off, reaffirming her position as one of the most captivating performers of her generation. Number 9. Jill Scott Jill Scott, born on April 4, 1972, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, emerged as a versatile artist celebrated for her soulful voice, poignant lyrics, and captivating stage presence. Discovered by musician Questlove in the late 1990s, Scott's debut album, Who Is Jill Scott? Words and Sounds Vol. 1, released in 2000, received critical acclaim and commercial success, earning her three Grammy nominations. Scott's distinct blend of neo-soul, R&B, and jazz resonated deeply with audiences, establishing her as a leading figure in the genre. Over the years, she has released several acclaimed albums, including Beautifully Human, Words and Sounds, Vol. 2 Inches, and The Light of the Sun, showcasing her powerful vocals and introspective songwriting. Hits like A Long Walk, Golden, and He Loves Me, Lizel in E-flat, have become anthems for fans worldwide highlighting Scott's ability to infuse her music with raw emotion and vulnerability. In 2024, she remains active in the music industry, continuing to release music and mesmerize audiences with her talents as a singer, songwriter, and actress. Now in her early 50s, Jill Scott emanates a natural beauty and confidence that complement her soulful voice and magnetic presence. Her enduring appeal stems not only from her musical prowess, but also from her authenticity and relatability with her fans, cementing her status as a revered artist in the industry. 
Before we continue further, tell us, are you enjoying the video? If yes, please like and share the video and subscribe to our channel to watch more videos on Black Africa. Let's continue now. Number 8. Chaka Khan Chaka Khan, born Yvette Marie Stevens on March 23, 1953, in Chicago, Illinois, emerged as a powerhouse singer-songwriter celebrated for her commanding vocals and dynamic stage presence. Initially rising to prominence as the lead vocalist of the funk band Rufus in the 1970s, Khan's unique voice and captivating performances propelled her solo career to unprecedented heights. In the late 1970s, Khan skyrocketed to solo stardom with chart toppers like I'm Every Woman and Ain't Nobody, solidifying her place in funk, R&B, and soul. Her raspy yet soulful voice, coupled with an irresistible charisma, endeared her to audiences worldwide. Throughout her illustrious career, Khan has earned multiple Grammy Awards and accolades for her musical contributions, including hits like Through the Fire and Tell Me Something Good. In 2024, Chaka Khan continues to delight audiences with her electrifying performances and timeless charm. Now in her 70s, Khan exudes a timeless elegance and confidence that have become synonymous with her persona over the years. Number 7. Diana Ross Diana Ross, born in Detroit, Michigan, on March 26, 1944, is celebrated as an American singer, actress, and record producer. Rising to prominence as the lead singer of the Supremes during the 1960s, Ross and the group became synonymous with the Motown sound, delivering hits like Where Did Our Love Go, Stop in the Name of Love, and You Can't Hurry Love. Transitioning to a solo career in the 1970s, Diana Ross quickly established herself as a powerhouse artist. Her debut solo album, Diana Ross, 1970, birthed the iconic anthem Ain't No Mountain High Enough, resonating as a symbol of empowerment. With subsequent successful albums like Touch Me in the Morning, 1973, and Diana, 1980, Ross showcased her versatility as an artist. Notably, her portrayal of Billie Holiday in Lady Sings the Blues, 1972, earned her an Academy Award nomination, highlighting her prowess in both film and music. In 2024, Diana Ross remains active in the entertainment scene, occasionally touring and making special appearances. Despite her age in her 80s, she continues to captivate audiences with her timeless elegance and charm. Number 6. Erica Badu Erica Badu, born Erica Abbey Wright on February 26, 1971, in Dallas, Texas, is recognized as an American singer-songwriter, actress, and record producer. Emerging as a leading figure in the neo-soul movement of the late 1990s, Badu's distinct voice and poignant lyrics set her apart. Her breakthrough came with her debut album, Baduism, 1997, which garnered both critical acclaim and commercial success. Tracks like On and On and Next Lifetime showcased her unique blend of soul, jazz, and hip-hop influences, drawing comparisons to legends such as Billie Holiday and Nina Simone. Throughout her career, Erica Badu has continually pushed artistic boundaries with albums like Mama's Gun, 2000, and New America Part 1, Fourth World War, 2008. Beyond music, she has ventured into acting and activism, advocating for social justice causes. In 2024, Erica Badu remains a dynamic presence in the music industry, renowned for her captivating performances and innovative creativity. Now in her early 50s, she exudes beauty and confidence, captivating audiences both on and off the stage. Number 5. Mariah Carey Mariah Carey, an acclaimed American singer, songwriter, and actress, is famous for her remarkable five-octave vocal range, powerful voice, and vast collection of chart-topping hits. She was born on March 27, 1969, in Huntington, New York, and her journey to stardom began in the early 1990s catapulting her to become one of the most successful music artists in history. Born to an African-American father of Venezuelan descent and her mother of Irish descent, she has mixed ethnicity. Her rise to fame commenced with the release of her self-titled debut album, Mariah Carey, in 1990. This debut masterpiece produced an impressive four number one singles on the Billboard Hot 100 chart, including memorable tracks like Vision of Love and Love Takes Time. Through this debut, Carey not only showcased vocal abilities, but also demonstrated her songwriting talent, earning her widespread acclaim and establishing her as a dominant force in the music industry. In the subsequent years, 
Carrie's career soared with the release of several critically acclaimed and commercially successful albums. Albums such as Emotions, 1991, featuring hits like the title track and Can't Let Go, and subsequent releases like Music Box, 1993, Daydream, 1995, and Butterfly, 1997, further highlighted Carrie's vocal versatility and songwriting skills, earning her numerous awards and accolades. One of Mariah Carey's most iconic songs is undoubtedly All I Want For Christmas Is You, released in 1994 as part of her holiday album Merry Christmas. This festive anthem has since become a timeless Christmas classic, cementing Carey's legacy in music history and standing as one of the best-selling singles of all time. In addition to her music career, Carey has ventured into acting, appearing in films such as Glitter, 2001, and Precious, 2009 where she received critical acclaim for her performances. As of 2024, Mariah Carey remains a prominent figure in the music industry, consistently releasing new music and stunning audiences worldwide with her live performances. Now in her mid-50s, Carey radiates charm and elegance, often captivating fans with her glamorous appearance and refined style. Despite the passage of time, her voice remains as enchanting as ever, solidifying her status as one of the greatest vocalists of her generation. Number four, Faith Evans. Faith Evans, an esteemed American singer, songwriter, record producer, and actress, emerged as a prominent figure in the 1990s music scene. Born on June 10, 1973, in Lakeland, Florida, Evans embarked on her musical journey at a young age, showcasing her talents in church choirs and local talent shows. Her exceptional vocal abilities and dynamic stage presence quickly attracted the attention of record executives. Evans's breakthrough came when she was signed to Bad Boy Records by Sean Diddy Combs in the mid-1990s. Her debut album, Faith, released in 1995, catapulted her into the spotlight with hits like You Used to Love Me and Soon As I Get Home, showcasing her powerful vocals and heartfelt songwriting. The commercial success of Faith solidified Evans as a rising star in the R&B, and soul music genres. Expanding on the triumph of her debut, Faith Evans continued to release a string of successful albums throughout the late 1990s and early 2000s. Albums such as Keep the Faith, 1998, Faithfully, 2001, and The First Lady, 2005, further established her reputation as one of RB's premier voices. Evans's music often explores themes of love, heartbreak, and resilience, resonating with audiences worldwide. Notable among Faith Evans' hits are Love Like This, I'll Be Missing You, a collaboration with Puff Daddy and 112, Again and All Night Long. These songs not only dominated the charts, but also became anthems for fans worldwide, solidifying Evans' status as a celebrated artist in the R&B genre. Beyond her music career, Faith Evans has ventured into various creative endeavors, including acting and entrepreneurship. She has graced the silver screen in films and television shows, and has delved into fashion and beauty with her own clothing and cosmetics lines. In 2024, Faith Evans remains an active presence in the music industry, continuously releasing music and captivating audiences globally with her performances. Now in her early 50s, Evans continues to be the center of attention due to her beauty and elegance, often mesmerizing fans with her timeless style and sophisticated demeanor. Number three, Janet Jackson. Janet Jackson is an iconic American singer, songwriter, actress, and dancer widely celebrated for her groundbreaking contributions to the music and entertainment industry. Born on May 16, 1966, in Gary, Indiana, she comes from the esteemed Jackson family, famous for birthing musical legends like her older brothers, members of the Jackson Five. Her journey to stardom began in the 1980s, transitioning from a child actress on television to embarking on a music career. In 1986, Janet released her pivotal album, Control, which marked a significant turning point in her artistic journey, showcasing newfound independence and maturity. Chart-topping hits such as What Have You Done For Me Lately, Nasty, and Control catapulted her into stardom, solidifying her reputation as a formidable presence in the music industry. Building on the success of Control, Janet continued her streak of chart-topping albums. Notably, her 1989 release, Rhythm Nation 1814 yielded hits like Miss You Much, Escapade, and Black Cat, characterized by socially conscious themes and groundbreaking music videos that further elevated her influence. 
The 1990s witnessed Janet Jackson achieving even greater commercial success with albums like Janet, 1993, and The Velvet Rope, 1997, featuring iconic anthems of the era such as That's the Way Love Goes, Together Again, and Got Till It's Gone. These releases underscored Janet's versatility and evolution as an artist, captivating audiences worldwide. Throughout her illustrious career, Janet has garnered numerous awards, including multiple Grammy Awards, Billboard Music Awards, and American Music Awards. Additionally, she has ventured into acting, delivering memorable performances in films like Poetic Justice, 1993, and Nutty Professor 2, The Clumps, 2000. In 2024, Janet Jackson remains a revered figure in the music industry, captivating audiences with her continued music releases and engaging presence. Now in her late 50s, Janet continues radiating timeless beauty and elegance, enchanting fans with her electrifying performances and stage presence. Despite the passage of time, her enduring influence on music and popular culture reaffirms her status as one of the greatest entertainers ever. Number two, Tony Braxton. Tony Braxton is widely acclaimed as a key figure in American music, renowned for her soulful vocals, heartfelt ballads, and significant impact on R&B. Born on October 7, 1967 in Severn, Maryland, Braxton's musical journey commenced at an early age as she sang alongside her sisters in church choirs. Her exceptional talent quickly caught the attention of record producers, sparking her desire for a professional music career. Braxton's breakthrough occurred in the early 1990s when she signed with LaFace Records and unveiled her debut album, simply titled Tony Braxton, in 1993. The album's lead single, Another Sad Love Song, swiftly climbed the charts, showcasing Braxton's commanding vocals and propelling her into the spotlight as an emerging star in the music industry. The immense success of her debut album earned Braxton critical acclaim and secured three Grammy Awards. In 1996, Braxton achieved even greater acclaim with the release of her second album, Secrets, featuring the timeless ballad, Unbreak My Heart. This iconic song captured the hearts of listeners worldwide, dominating charts and cementing Braxton's status as a musical icon. Secrets went on to become one of the highest selling albums ever by a female artist, sending Braxton's career to unparalleled heights. Throughout her illustrious career, Toni Braxton has continued to deliver hit albums such as The Heat, 2000, More Than a Woman, 2002, and Pulse, 2010. Her music often explores themes of love, heartbreak, and resilience, resonating deeply with audiences of all ages. Braxton's distinctive voice and emotionally charged performances have earned her numerous awards and accolades, firmly establishing her as one of the most beloved figures in R&B. In 2024, Tony Braxton remains an active presence in the music industry, consistently releasing new music and captivating audiences worldwide with her performances. Now in her late 50s, Braxton continues to captivate fans with her timeless beauty and refined charm, often leaving audiences spellbound with her glamorous presence and graceful demeanor. Despite the passage of time, her voice retains its soulful depth and magnetic allure, ensuring her enduring legacy as an icon in the realm of music. Number one, Mary J. Blige. Mary J. Blige is a living legend who is famously known as the queen of hip hop soul. She holds a powerful position in American music and boasts a diverse career as a singer, songwriter, and actress. Born on January 11, 1971, in the Bronx, New York City, Bleach quickly rose to fame in the early 1990s, captivating audiences with her unique fusion of R&B, soul, and hip-hop influences. Bleach's journey to stardom began with her signing to Uptown Records in 1989. Her debut album, What's the 411, released in 1992, introduced audiences to her distinctive vocal style, coupled with authentic and relatable lyrics. The album's innovative blend of hip-hop beats with soulful melodies marked a revolutionary shift in R&B music, earning Blige widespread acclaim and recognition. A pivotal moment in Blige's career came with the chart-topping success of her debut album single, Real Love. This early triumph was swiftly followed by hits like You Remind Me and Reminisce, firmly establishing Blige as a rising star in the music industry. In 1994, Blige further solidified her status as an R&B icon with the release of her second album, My Life. Widely regarded as one of the greatest albums in the genre's history, 
My life delved into themes of love, pain, and personal growth, resonating deeply with audiences. The album's emotionally charged tracks, combined with Bleach's powerful vocals, garnered critical acclaim and propelled her to new heights of success. Hits like Be Without You, No More Drama, and Family Affair continued to underscore Bleach's dominance in the realm of R&B music. Throughout her illustrious career, Mary J. Blige has released numerous successful albums, earning her multiple Grammy Awards and other prestigious accolades. Additionally, she has ventured into acting, delivering memorable performances in films such as Mudbound, which earned her critical acclaim and an Academy Award nomination. In 2024, Mary J. Blige maintains her influential presence in the music industry, fascinating audiences worldwide with her ongoing music releases and live performances. Now in her early 50s, Bleach preserves the same charm and beauty she had in her early career. Did you see any of these black singers performing back in the days when they were at their peak? Tell us, which of these singers is your favorite and whether you listen to their songs to this day? In the comment section right below, share your thoughts on whether their songs were timeless and suitable for all eras. Do you want to watch more videos like this one? If yes, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon next to it. We bring videos on Black Africa, its history, rich arts and culture, and things the world should know about. Thanks for watching and until the next video, stay tuned.